The Michigan Wolverines came into Ludwig Field Friday night, boasting the second highest scoring offense in the Big Ten. But the Maryland back line did not falter, holding the Wolverines scoreless for a full 90 minutes as Maryland picked up their first conference win in over two seasons. Straight from kickoff, opportunity came knocking for the Turks. After a long ball out the back, Michaela Days whipped a dangerous ball into the box, and after a deflection, Catherine DeRosa had her shot parried by Michigan goalkeeper Izzy Nino. Michigan then took control of the possession, controlling the pace of play while taking the game to the turf. The Wolverines came closest when an awkward cross came into the danger area that ran off the post, but no one was home to tap in the rebound, and the Turks got off unscathed. That would be the last good chance of the first half, as the Terps were left with a message by their leader at halftime. Well, we spoke about 45 minutes to make history. We spoke about 45 minutes to dig deep, give everything that they have for this program, for this Maryland pride. The Terps started the second half strong. Alina Stahl forced a save from Nino 10 minutes into the half, and Alyssa Porch followed Stahl's effort with a shot of her own, again being denied by the Michigan back line. We literally spend so much time on defense, and defense is like one of Meg's biggest things to win the championship. So she's a great defensive coach, and she allows us to play offensively by how we defend. With 20 minutes to play, Days found herself on the end of a Juliana Lynch cross, and her leaping header found a way past Nino to give the Terps the breakthrough. I just, like, Jules is like a great player. She plays great ball, so I saw she had the ball, and I saw it, and I just went for it. Michigan thought they had equalized when Casey Lawrence slid one past Maddie Smith, but an offsides flag saved the Terps. The Terps will hold on to the final 15 minutes, earning their first Big Ten Conference win since 2019. It means everything. You saw how we celebrated. Yeah. Like, it's like we just won the World Cup. Like, this is, you know, we, we love this. We want to keep this going. So. The Terps will play host to the Fighting Illini of Illinois Thursday night before heading the road to take on coach Megan Ryan Nemser's former squad in the Rutgers Scarlet Knights. For Terrapin Sports Central, from Ludwig Field, I'm Matthew News.